In 2017, Jinchow Technology was listed as an important project under China United Nations Peace and Development Fund. On May 26th, the permanent mission of China and the United States of Economic and Social Affairs of the United Nations jointly held the launching ceremony for Jintao Project at the United Nations headquarters in New York. Since then, Andasar and Fujian Agriculture and Forestry University have together held Jinchao Technology side event on the 13th section of the Conference of the Parties to the UNCCD and the Regional Capacity Building Workshop on Jinchao Technology for Pacific Small Island Developing States in China and Fiji, respectively. Jingchao technology is considered as fitting the special conditions and needs of developing challenges including poverty, hunger, unemployment, and climate change for developing countries, and helping the implementation of the 2030 Sustainable Development Agenda, thus enhancing global development. After more than 30 years' development, 46 species of grass have already been selected and bred as main materials for cultivation of 55 kinds of edible and medicinal mushrooms which can be further processed into highly value-added tiny food products and even the spent substrates can still be processed into functional feed and feed additives. Some Jinchao grass species are high-quality forage themselves Jinchao grass is a big burly plant with strong adaptability, fast growth, well-developed root system, can drastically improve the ecological control speed with much reduced cost. Jinchao grass can be used for mushroom production as animal feed, fertilizer for biomass fuel and biomass materials production, etc which has grown up to a highly yielding, fine quality, highly efficient, environment-friendly, as well as safe technical system and emerging industry. Fujian Agriculture and Forestry University of China was the first to develop and utilize Jintao technology for ecological management since 1993. In 20 years of unremitting efforts by far food scientists, with numerous experiments and demonstrations carried out from China's Qinghai-Tibet Plateau, the Yellow River Basin, Taklaimakan Desert, and even to the source of the Nile River in Africa, the South American Plateau, and many other places in the world, Jinchao Technology has achieved a series of internationally leading research results. In Inner Mongolia, giant Jinchao grass was adopted as the pioneer plant and fixed the sand dunes after only 80 days. A cluster of giant Jinchao grass could fix 15.2 square meters sand in 120 days. Although the giant Jinchao grass there was an annual plant, the roots could still fix the sand for the following four consecutive years after harvest. In Rwanda, the lands planted with giant Jinchao grass in comparative with the land of traditional maize cropping, the soil loss was reduced by more than 97%, and the runoff water decreased by more than 80%. The annual yield of first giant fresh chow grass planted in Papua New Guinea reached 853 tons per hectare. Jinchao technology has over the years been extensively applied for poverty alleviation and rural development. The Chinese government listed Jinchao technology as economic aid projects for Papua New Guinea, Rwanda, Lesotho and Fiji respectively. Chinese Jinchao Technology Demonstration Centers and numerous Jinchao Technology flagship sites were established as platforms for mobilizing and empowering those poor grassroots farmers who lacked land resources, mostly non-educated without adequate skills, especially women and youths, to learn skills of Jinchao Technology and engage them into the Jintao industry, which is of low investment, with quick returns and high economic benefits. 
so, they quickly increased their income and mostly lifted out of poverty and backwardness. Effectively enhanced the win-win situation in combined ecological, economic, and social development, and has actually created a Jinchao model for integrity ecological management, well connected with poverty alleviation. And we really appreciate what it's doing. So I think that it's going to bridge the gap between technology transfer, the technologies that are in China that we don't have here. The, the um, ways of the, the means and ways that it's reaching farmers is also new. China Fujian province forged sisterly provincial relations with the Eastern Highland province of PNG and with KwaZulu NATO province of South Africa, all with the contributions of Jinchao Technology as the matchmaker. Jinchao Technology originates from China and now serves the whole world. We are committed to the aim of develop Jinchao industry, benefit the mankind, and will devote ourselves to help achieve the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development of the United Nations. Let us join hands and work together to turn desert into oasis and build a harmonious and a beautiful happy homeland.